what's going on YouTube it's your boy Demonte the trucker thank y'all and uh, welcome to my channel we just got to the truck trying to start it up but I don't want to start up we was going ahead to get my trailer to put it on to hook up and come back where we parked at so we'd be ready for Monday morning because yesterday I was waiting on a load and they couldn't find me a load how you coming to can't find a load but it's okay we ain't gonna stress over too much trying to start this bad boy up don't want to start up the battery probably dead so yeah you two don't want to start up now i'm about to head back to my car and uh text my dispatch and let them know first thing monday morning i'm gonna need a uh a jump at least i'm gonna need a jump at least you two but y'all know what it is man stressing over anything is trucking everything else look look pretty good did a little pre-trip it's just the, the battery don't want to start up Everything's still secure. Gotta put some more lube on it. Well, yeah, YouTube. Boy, I just came to the truck. Try to go ahead to get the trailer. But, gotta let them know. I ain't want to start up. That's the thing. Once you sit for a while. I couldn't find... Couldn't find the shut off switch. Couldn't find the shuttle switch to shut the truck off. But yeah, it's been parked for, it's been sitting for like two days. Cut off the music. But it's been sitting for like two days. I tried to get it to start, but I ain't want to start. Just got to let them know. But you two, while we sitting there, let's bring up, uh, been asked some questions on What's my opinion on job hopping when you should quit? Quit your trucking company and whatnot. Let me start by saying this. Have you been with your trucking company for less than, the current company for less than three months? There's no reason you should quit. I know trucking can get be hard, but you just gotta work through. Because the thing you gotta ask yourself is, once you quit that trucking company, go to another truck trucking company, what makes you think you're not gonna have the same same problems with the next trucking company? Whether it be finding, well, if you were a trucking company, flatbed general, you can't find freight, like your dispatcher can't find freight in your area, which I had a problem with Friday, which it's been a, it's been a bad week this week. I only had two loads, which is not gonna equal up to a thousand dollars for this week. But it's okay, YouTube. You're going to go through your ups and downs. But is that a is that a reason I should quit? Go look for another trucking company? What's guarantees to say I won't? That with another trucking company, I won't have the same problems I have with this company. I've been with this company going on five months, six months. It, it hasn't been too bad to where... I mean, you want to look for it different companies with better things to offer but I'm 21 I'm limited to companies I could go to as of this point so it it really doesn't matter if I job hop to go to like the company I with now is a smaller flatbed company only got 700 to 800 drivers total overall lease purchase company and on ops so it's really not a big company a smaller company you're gonna have your issues with smaller company but finding freight in some areas but that's trucking i mean i could have went to the bigger companies but what bigger company have you home every weekend and making good still making good money decent money starting out so i can't really complain but i don't think you should uh job hop if you have well in my case i'm 21 so it really don't make sense for me to job hop because i ain't gonna really find too much of a better company without a year experience i got eight months of experience so far driving all flatbed so 
it really don't make sense in my situation. But I'm not gonna tell you to not job hop, but I'm not gonna tell you to job hop. If you're gonna job hop, make sure it's gonna benefit you in your situation. I can't sit here to tell you don't do it because your situation might be different from mine. But yeah, YouTube is not always gonna be great. This week was a bad week. I'm gonna tell y'all, take y'all through the journey with me and let y'all know it's not always gonna be great. I know they have some YouTubers just give y'all the good side of things, but I'm gonna give you the real deal of how everything's going and the things I dislike about this company. But it's not too bad to uh, to make you want to quit. And the, another question you got to ask yourself before you quit, is it you? Is it you not putting in 110% in your craft? Or is it actually the company? You just got to self-reflect and look back to see. Because it really can be rewarding. You just got to get through the trenches, the hard times of trucking. Starting out is going to be hard. If you don't have a year experience, you can't go to too many companies. So that's what I, I want to touch bases on with y'all today. Just something that was on my mind. Not too big, not too long of a video. But yeah, YouTube, we got to the truck. And want, I wanted to go get the trailer and park back where I parked at, at this Walmart. So I'd be ready for Monday. I won't have to start my clock to go get the trailer and then wait on the load. I could just already have the trailer and I wouldn't have to start my clock before he dispatched me on the load. But it's going to be all right. I can't can't control that, right, YouTube? But yeah, man, that's another key thing in trucking. If you can go without starting your clock until you get dispatched on a load or dispatched on something, do it so you have a full clock to run, get loaded, and things of that nature. But thank y'all for tuning in. Thank y'all for watching. I just wanted to talk about something that was on my mind. Y'all stay up. And always. Stay positive. Stay confident in yourself. But like I said, YouTube, I'm going to uh, head back to the house to run some errands I got to run and get, reach out to my dispatch and let them know communication is key. But y'all stay up, man. And always, man, stay positive. It's your boy, Demonte the Trucker. We out. What up, what up, what up? It's your boy, Demonte the Trucker. Thank y'all for watching.